<laughs> um, speak. 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 Talk to me. Is it working? <laughs> yeah, I can hear you speaking. No, I can hear you speaking. It's fine. Yeah, and the scratching noises is cutting just. <laughs> okay, it works. That's good. You don't sound like shit. And. Okay. Stop talking over her. Whoop, well, speak. Yes, I have a cat on my lap, and she's waking up and wanting to bite me. Ow. Good. Violence today. I am gonna grab my tea. You guys can make conversation. Um. Give me a second. How do I fix this? Where's the thing? Uh, well, can you see my chat? No, I cannot. Okay. Um. You could probably stream. Okay. Don't ever see it. Um, I could try and open. Wait, that's not. I'm trying to open. Okay, so okay. the game just doesn't like to be on full screen. That's good to know. Good. I'll try and open Twitch to get the chat. Okay. Yeah. yeah, I think you can do that. No? Okay, I think I have this. Tasha, say something. Can you hear me? <laughs> <laughs> Tasha, say something. She can hear you. Yeah. She can't hear me? Okay, mm -hmm. I can see you now. Oh my gosh. Now I just need to see the screen of the thing and then I can talk. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna get my tea and I'm gonna get some water and I'll be back. God, where are you going? I'm not dumb whatsoever. I am. It's I am I am the being known as Vic. I am in my light headed mood. <laughs> How could he? This man, this betrayer didn't put me in the title. <gasps> He's using my He's not using my name. <laughs> I was gonna say he's using he's using my name for entertainment. <laughs> All right. This is beard. This beach. This suntan lotion. What are you saying about my suntan lotion? I'm yelling at you because <laughs> I'm yelling at you because you haven't put my name in the title of the train. Or right, do you sense it? What? You sense it? You have it. Oh right. I have it. I'll do it after stream because if I open Chrome, everything's gonna go to shut. I am going to have to meet myself at some point because then my mother's gonna come and then she's gonna be a big beep 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 and then start talking on stream. So I'm gonna have to meet myself very quickly. Can you kiss your mother that note? Huh? Can you kiss your mother that note? Yes, actually, because I haven't said anything bad, Suntan Lotion. <laughs> um, when you do that, I'll just like either pause or just carry on. Okay, I guess it's time to start now. Let the live audience know who Whoopers <laughs> love her censoring herself. <laughs> I mean, you don't necessarily need to censor yourself. But your, your stream is PG-13 and I curse like a sailor. 
I mean, I play very violent games with swearing in it, so... Individuals suffering from anxiety or depression may not have a safe experience playing this game. For content warnings, please visit... I'm still not sharing my stream, by the way. Thank you for telling me. For content warnings, please visit ddlc.mo slash warning.html. Hello, Sirico. Why does a cute game like this have content warnings about anxiety and depression? I don't know what this game is about. I think it's a dating sim. By playing DDLC, you agree that you are at least 13 years of age and you consent to your exposure of highly disturbing content. What's disturbing about this? Don't worry about it. Agree. I agree. Good. This is why you always read the fine print. It seems to work, probably, I assume. I hope so. This game is not suitable for children or those who are highly disturbed. Let's play a new game. Cabin. Right. Yes, that works. Hey. Ah, uh, well, it's your job. No, it's my job, I think. I think this is my job, no? I see an annoying girl running towards me from the distance, waving her arms in the air like she's totally oblivious to any attention she might draw to herself. That girl is Sayori, my neighbor and good friend since we were children. You know, the kind of friend you'd never see yourself making today, but just kind of works out because you've known each other for so long. That's how I feel about Tashi. We used to walk to school together on days like this. But starting around high school, she would oversleep more and more frequently, and I would get tired of waiting up. But if she's going to chase after me like this, I almost feel better off running away. However, I just sigh and idle in front of the crosswalk and let Sayori catch up to me. Your job. I have breathing sounds. Maybe, but only because I decided to stop and wait for you. Oh, that's my job. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe, but only because I decided to stop and wait for you. <laughs> well, if people stare at you for acting weird, then I don't want them to think we're a couple or something. Fine. My dog is looking at me in concern. As he should. Apparently, I'm better at Hmm? But you did wait for me after all. I guess you don't have it have it in you to be me, even if you want to. Yeah, yeah, but because I like I'm tweaking the audio as you go along. Nice. Whatever you say, Sayori. <laughs> we I cross the street a, together uh, and make our way to school. I need to get a more concrete voice for Sayori. I can't I need to remember the voice I sing with her in. <laughs> It'll come to you eventually, don't worry about it. Eventually. As we draw near, the streets become increasingly speckled with other students making their daily commutes. I know, right, Tashi? I'm adorable. That's debatable. Wait, wait, wait. Heavy? <laughs> I know, wait, heavy? Have you decided on joining a club on a club yet? <laughs> a club? I told you already, I'm not really interested in joining any clubs. I haven't been looking either. I'm too good for clubs. They wish they had me. Hey? You? You're horrible! You told me you would 
you would join a club this year. Yeah, well, I lied to you. Right. Did I? <laughs> Kinda does. You're like a crazy lady. I'm sure it's possible that I did. In one of our many conversations where I dismissively go along with whatever she's going on about. Yeah, that sounds like me. She really likes to worry a little too much about me when I'm perfectly content, just getting on by the average, while spending my free time on games and anime. <laughs> no. You don't have to do me like that, game. Which one is that? I was talking about how I'm worried that you would learn how to socialize, but you don't have any skills before college. Okay? It's just the way I'm so. <laughs> the happiness is really important, you know. I have to do time on three minutes when I push the record. I think a Paimon voice would work for them. And I should also mute my phone. And I know you're happy now, but I die at the thought of you becoming a neat <laughs> in a few years because you're not used to the real world. <laughs> a neat! Oh my gosh! I can't imagine it! You trust me, right? Don't make me keep worrying about you. Alright, alright. I'll look at a few clubs if it makes you happy. No promises though. Will you at least miss me you'll try a little? Yeah, I guess I'll promise you that. Why do I let myself get lectured by such a carefree girl? More than that, I'm surprised I even let myself relent to her. I guess seeing her worry so much about me makes me want... <laughs> yeah, definitely don't clip the neat part. <laughs> you didn't hear the neat part? That was like a really good part. You're horrible. Yeah, you're horrible. You're the worst. I guess seeing her worry so much about me makes me want to ease her mind at least a little bit. Even if she does exa exaggerate everything inside her head. Oh my gosh, we have so much in common. I will raise her volume more. I'm going to turn down the game music a little bit as well. I could try going on my computer again to see if that works. Wait, I want to try going on my computer again so that it is entirely holding up my phone. Give me a second. Okay. We're gonna wait for her. Cut. Hello. Is it working? Um, you sound far away. Uh. You need to raise your um, Discord audio input. How now? Yes, that's so much better. Yay. I can turn it up a little bit. There we go. Um, guys, there how is she? Go. On a scale of uh, 1 to 10. How is... Oh, uh, uh, I'm asking them how you are. Okay, nice. Better for me, nice. <laughs> I'm amazing. You don't need to ask them. I'll tell you. You you tell me. You know. <laughs> Whoop knows best. I'll tell you how amazing I am. The school day is as ordinary as ever. And it's over before I know it. After I pack up my things, I stare blankly at the wall, looking for an ounce of motivation. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Clubs. Sari wants me to check out some clubs. I guess I have no choice but to start with an anime club. You're gonna There's come an at anime me. club? Hello. 
Sayori. Sayori must have come into the classroom while I was spacing out. I look around and realize that I'm the only one left in the classroom. Yes, you, you imbecile! Why are you looking around like you're a ghost? I thought I'd catch you coming out the classroom, but I saw you just sitting there and spacing out like you were high. So I came in. <laughs> Honestly, you're even worse than me sometimes. I'm impressed. You don't need to wait up for me if it's going to make you late for your own club, you worry head. Well, I thought you might need some encouragement, so I thought, you know... <laughs> no, what? <laughs> yeah, don't, why are you acting like my mother? Huh? <laughs> Well, then you could come to my club. If there are thick mouths, then yes. <laughs> but you're clearly neither of those, so. <laughs> Sayori. Yeah. You can't say no. You're my prisoner. There's no way I'm going to your club. <laughs> Me. So you're as vice president of the literature club. Not that I was ever aware that she had any interest in literature. In fact, I'm 99% sure she only did it because she thought it would be fun to start a new club. Since she was the first one to show interest after the one who proposed the club, she inherited the title of vice president. That said, my interest in lit literature is going to be even less. Yeah, I'm going to the anime club. Literature club is the best. Come on! Is it really the best? I don't know, I haven't been in one, but I want to. <laughs> Why do you care so much anyway? It seems like a bunch of nerds just reading books. But that's the best part! <laughs> Maybe it's because I just can't read. Why do you care so much anyway? <laughs> well... I kind of told the club yesterday I would bring a new member. Oh god damn it. Ha! I told you you couldn't say no. Look, you make cupcakes and everything! Okay, cupcakes <laughs> might be a way to get me to join the club. Cupcakes are the best way. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, if someone wanted to kidnap me, all they'd have to do is show me a tray of cupcakes and tell me I can tell me. That I can eat all if I want to. Did your parents not say don't go in the white van, Kevin? They didn't say white specifically, but... Cupcakes. <laughs> that is also another thing that would make me join a club. Don't make promises you can't that keep. Yeah. I can't tell if Sarah is, that, is really that much of an airhead. Or if she's so cunning as to have planned all of this out. I let us along, say. <laughs> Fine, I'll stop by for a cupcake, okay? Yes! Let's go! <laughs> She's turning more and more into a kraken. <laughs> yeah. And thus today marks the day I sold my soul for a cupcake. <laughs> <laughs> I dejectedly follow Sayori ac across the school and upstairs, a section of the school I rarely visit. Being generally used for their classes and activities. Sayori, full of energy, swings open the classroom door. Oh, a new clip. Really cool. nice. Yeah, huh? the clip potential in this. <laughs> Mm hmm All of the clippage. Oh my gosh. I told you, don't call me a new member. Uh, I glance around the room. Welcome to the Literature Club. It's pretty. It's a pleasure to meet you. <laughs> Hello. Sayori always says nice things about you. Though she seems to be wrong. 
Seriously? Oh, you brought a boy? Oh. <laughs> I can't only voice this one. Okay, Paimon. Paimon, okay. I need you. <laughs> Seriously? You brought a boy? <clears throat> Way to kill the atmosphere. <laughs> I'm not gonna use my normal voice for this one. <laughs> Ah, Kevin, what a nice surprise. Never mind. Welcome to the club. Let's get high together. <laughs> Why is everybody turning into drug addicts? <laughs> All words escape me in this situation. This club is full of incredibly cute girls. <laughs> oh what are God. you looking at? If you want to say something, say it! Bitch! <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Atsuki. The girl with the sour attitude whose name is Natsuki is one I don't That's recognize. So Her small figure makes me think she's probably a first year. She's also the one who made cupcakes according to Sayori. You can just say, <clears throat> you can just ignore her <laughs> when she gets moody. <laughs> I'm always cracked to switching the voices. <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. Sayori says that quietly into my ear, then turns back to what the other girls. I also want cupcakes. She reminds me of Ellie a bit more. More hmm. what? More what? More, more. Who reminds you of Ellie? Tashi said that. Oh. More, more, more what? Spit it out! Spit it out! I too want cupcakes. Yeah, spit it out. He should. Yes. He really should sponsor us drivers. I anyway. I remember the green sponsor anyway. Tashi Gyros. This is not Suki. This is not Suki. Always full of energy. And this is Yuri, the smartest in the club. Don't don't, don't say things like that. Kevin, this is our one man show. Shut <laughs> up. You're just advertising. Like You're just advertising. Wait. Your voice acting talent. <laughs> Wait, you want to voice Sayori since she would probably have your lower voice? Yeah. Yuri? Not Sayori, sorry. Yuri. Yes. <clears throat> <clears throat> Don't say things like that. <laughs> Yuri, who appears completely more mature and timid, seems to have a hard time keeping up with people like Sayori and Natsuki. Oh well, it's <laughs> nice to meet both of you. <laughs> and it sounds like you already know Matka, is that right? That's right. <laughs> it's great to see you again, Kevin. I'm uh, hair flip, of course. Monica smiles sweetly. They were dating, weren't they? The breathier voice? Breathy voice. Billy Eilish singing, you know? Or kind of like a raspy voice? Breathe out when you are speaking her mind. <laughs> okay. We don't know each other well. We rarely talk, but we were in the same class last year. Monica is probably the most popular girl in that class. Smart, beautiful, athletic. Basically completely out of my league. So having smiled at me so genuinely feels a little... Y you too, Monica. We made a room for you at the table, so just you can sit next to me or Monica. I'll get the cupcakes. What does a calm voice sound like? I don't know. What does it mean to be calm? Also, yes, Sarika. Sarika. Kevin does not know different types of voices, not at all. Yeah, I can't do That's voices. Cool. I'm gonna be... I'm his coach. <laughs> I've taken the mantle of becoming a coach now. 
sweet but calm. I don't even do a voice kind oh, of. Oh, sorry. 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 I got a little too excited. No, like my hand is on the space key and like sometimes it just like drops down. Then take it off. Yeah, that's Horrible. a good idea. <laughs> oh my gosh. Then how about I make some tea as well? No, I feel like I Breath, do that properly. Yeah. Then how about I make some tea? You just sound <laughs> like an old man at the end. <laughs> yeah. The girls have a so few desks arranged to form a table. Yes, I should probably do that. I'll see you safe. Oh yeah, I should save. This game doesn't have to be put in full screen. Hello, I was no check. I was no check. Hello. Oh, time to the follow. What's the hizzy hops? Yes. What's the happenings? The girls have a few just to reach in the form of a table. Okay, hi Snow. I am going to save, to save now. There we go. Greetings, Snow. How is it hanging? <laughs> he just lags when she when he says the username. <laughs> I already been broken by that username. I got it, I got it. You don't have to make fun of me now. <laughs> but that's the easiest thing to do though. Yeah, why are you so okay with picking low hanging fruit all the time? Because that's the easiest fruit to get, obviously. Um, I'm good. Um, I have Whoop on here doing voices for the characters. She's nice. Yeah, I'm amazing. Ha! Wow. Hair flip. Hair flip. <laughs> but friends like this, right? You're already the absolute worst. Uh, come on. Yeah, I'm pretty sure everyone here knows more about the game than I do. I've yes. somehow managed to avoid spoilers for this game since it came out. I don't know how. It got pretty big. Now let's play the game. <laughs> the girls have a few dust arranged to form a table. I think I read that already. Yes, As Sayori mentioned, it's been widened so that there's one space next to Monica and one space next to Sayori. Natsuki and Yuri walk over to the corner of the room. When Natsuki grabs a wrap tray and Yuri opens the closet. Still feeling awkward, I take a seat next to Sayori. Natsuki proudly marches back to the table, tray in hand. Natsuki loves the foil of the tray to reveal a dozen white fluffy cupcakes decorated to look like little cats. Aww. Daddy? The it whiskers. Looks like <laughs> I wouldn't doubt that. The whiskers are drawn with icing and little pieces of chocolate were used to make ears. Yeah, that sounds like cotton. Okay, what's a you said calm, cute voice. Um uh, sweet. Uh I had no idea you were so good at baking, that's okay. <laughs> well, you know. Just hurry and take one. Stuff it in your throat! <laughs> Sari grabs one, this and then Monica, and I follow. I would take Delicious. more. Oh my gosh! <laughs> she just continues these things. Oh my gosh! <laughs> it's delicious! Sarah talks with a mouthful and has already managed to get icing on her face. Oh no. Wait, I. It's so <laughs> I turned the cupcake. <laughs> oh, what were you saying? Continue, continue, oh. go. I turned the cupcake around my in my fingers. Looking for the best angle to take a bite. Natsuki is quiet. I can't help but notice her sneaking glances in my direction. Is she waiting for me to take a bite? No, she's waiting to choke. 
<laughs> she wants me to offer her a cupcake. I finally bite down. Yeah. The icing is sweet and full of flavor. I wonder if she made this herself. This is really good. Thank you, Natsuki. Oh, Why? It's not my guy. <laughs> Haven't I heard this somewhere before? Made this for you or anything? It's not like I made them for you or anything. <laughs> Uh, I thought you technically did say or you said. Well, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> she is. But not for you, you know. You dummy. I knew it. She said it. <laughs> she said it. Alright, alright. I give up on Natsuki's bad logic and dismiss the conversation. Yuri returns to the table carrying a tea set. She carefully places a teacup in front of each of us before setting down the teapot next to the cupcake tray. Clean clank. You keep a whole tea set in this classroom? <laughs> you you must oh, right, remember. Right. Don't worry, Do the teachers breathless. gave us permission. Nice. After all, doesn't a hot cup of tea help you enjoy a good book? The mic is not so smart. The MC, main character. Not so smart, no. Oh, right, the MC. I, I can't read you guys, I'm sorry. Uh, I, I guess. The MC seems like an. Wow, okay, I'm not gonna finish that MC sentence. MC Kevin. <laughs> <laughs> Don't let yourself be get intimidated. Yuri is just trying to impress you. <laughs> huh? That's not... Insulted, Yuri looks away. Oh, wow. I meant that, you know... She I believe you. Want to be, it's insinuated that she likes you. <laughs> mm -hmm. Well, tea and reading might not be a pastime for me, but at least... But I at least enjoy tea. Yeah, she seems like a big sus. Sus energy. I'm glad. Sus. Big sus energy. <laughs> I don't- I can't do a girl voice. I don't know- Try, what, Kevin! I don't know what girls shame. sound like. I'm try. No, huh? I don't know what girls sound like. Excuse me? <laughs> Yuri faintly smiles to herself in relief. Don't Monica. just rush over that! <laughs> <laughs> no, I... <laughs> Monica raises an eyebrow and smells... <laughs> okay, I'll try it. I'll try it out next time. Okay, okay. So what made you consider the literature club? Um... I was afraid of this question. Something tells me I shouldn't tell Monica. I was practically dragged here by Sayori. Well, I haven't joined any clubs yet, and Sayori seemed really happy here, so... That's okay. Oh. That's okay, don't be embarrassed. I sound like a man sometimes, don't worry about it. <laughs> we'll make sure you feel right at home, okay? Okay, okay, I can't do the rolling R thing, okay? Okay. As president of the literature club, it's my duty to make the club fun and exciting for everyone. Monica, I'm She's surprised. She's gonna turn into Siri. Come again? She's gonna turn into Siri. <laughs> yeah. How come you decided to start your own club? You could probably be a board member for any of the major clubs. Weren't you a leader of the debate club last year? To be honest, I can't stand all of the politics around the major clubs. It feels like nothing but arguing about the budget and publicity and how to prepare for events. Prepare for events! <laughs> <laughs> I'd much 
much rather, she did say it in English, I much rather pick something I personally enjoy and make something special out of it. Ah. And if it encourages others to t get into literature, then I'm, then I'm fulfilling the dream. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Monica really is a great leader. Yuri also not in agreement. Hermione voice. <laughs> then I'm surprised there aren't more people in this club yet. It must be hard to start a new club. I didn't put it that way. Not many people. Not many people are very interested in putting out all the effort and starting something brand new. Especially when it's something that doesn't grab your attention, like literature. 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 You have to work hard to convince people that you're not fun and worthwhile. That you're both fun and worthwhile. So that's what the cupcakes were for, Auntie. Of course, it's bribery. <laughs> but it makes the school events like the festival much more important. I'm confident that we'll all really. Well, I'm confident that we can all really grow in this club before we graduate. I mean, I'm gonna leave soon, but yeah, probably. I'm the president, so I always leave soon. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> yes, do it. Do it. <laughs> we'll do our best. <laughs> I sound like an old grandmother. <laughs> Do it! I barely heard you! Commit! Commit, Kevin! <laughs> you know it! <laughs> you know it! She just Everyone like enthusiastically good. agrees. Such different girls. Snap, snap. Hmm? What was that you said? Good said? job. Oh. oh, thank you. Such different yeah, girls. All up. interested in the same goal. Monica must have looked really hard just to find these three. Maybe that's why they're all so delighted by the idea of a new member joining. Though I still don't really know if I can keep up with their level of enthusiasm about literature. <clears throat> okay, time to remember how I did that voice. Continue. So, Kavi, what kind of... <clears throat> so, Kavi, what Come kind on. of things do you like her to read? Yeah! Well, uh, considering how little I've read these past few years, I don't really have a good way of answering that. Mango? Mango? <laughs> I mutter quietly to myself, half joking. Whoa! Natsuki's head suddenly perks up. It looks like she wants to say something, but she keeps quiet. Not much of a reader, I guess. Well, that can change. For a cupcake. What am I saying? An act of service. I spoke without thinking after seeing Yuri's sad smile. Anyway, what about you, Yuri? Well, let's see. Ah! Yuri traces the rim of a teacup with a finger. My favorites are usually novels that build deep and complex fantasy worlds. I found that. I'm gonna get snacked. I guess it's sticky. Sticky. Guts. Because it starts with us. The level of creativity and craftsmanship behind them is amazing to me. And telling a good story in such a foreign world is equally impressive. Yuri goes on, clearly passionate about her reading. She seems so reserved and timid since the moment I walked in, but it's so obvious by the way her eyes light up after she finds her comfort in the world of books, not people. But you know, I like a lot of things. Stories with deep psychological elements usually miss me as well. You can't ban me, I can ban you though. 
But please don't leave. I like having you here. Although all you do is make fun of me. And sometimes compliment me. That's fine. <laughs> exactly. You can't ban the streamer. Isn't it amazing how a writer can so deliberately take advantage of your own lack of imagination to completely throw you for a loop? Anyway, I've been reading a lot of horror lately. Ah, I read a horror book once. I desperately grasp something I can relate to at a minimal level. Yeah, I said you compliment me sometimes. At this rate, Yuri might as well be having a conversation with a rock. I'm back. Oh, just in, in just time. In time. I'm amazing. I'm you amazing. Are, you're super amazing. Good job. <laughs> really? I wouldn't have expected that, Yuri. I just took a sip of my tea and burnt my tongue. Huh. I got a pie. Fudgy nice. pie from, from TJ Fridays. Continue. <clears throat> really? <laughs> Was someone as gentle as you? I guess you can say that. But if a story makes me think, or takes me to another world, then I can't really put it down. Surreal horror is often very successful at changing the way you look at the world, if only for a brief, brief moment. Ugh, I hate horror! I hate horror! Oh? Why is that? Because I'm a pussy! <laughs> <laughs> I feel like my entire channel is just gonna be on the clips. Oh. <laughs> I'm honestly, I, I vibe with us. <laughs> well, I just. Oh, so, oh, you didn't read that? No, I did. I just oh. read it over. Natsuki's eyes dart over to me for a split second. That's right, you usually like to write about cute things, don't you, Natsuki? Oh, what? <coughs> what gives you that idea? Sariha, we are. Sariha, why do I keep saying Sariha? <laughs> we are just fine, trust me. Probably. I have a gun to my head. Help! <laughs> You left a piece of scrap paper behind last club meeting. Oof. Sorry, ha. Huh? Sorry, ha. It looks like you were working on a poem called. Don't say it out loud! And get that back! Snatch. Fireflies. Firefight. Claws. Take over your channel. You're lucky your camera's off. Of course, because I'm, uh, I'm just so good. <laughs> you are so good. You're really good. Stop making me more confident, Kevin. <laughs> Isn't that a good Hi. thing, though? <laughs> I'm gonna actually take over your channel. <laughs> Isn't it like a good thing to gas your friends up? I do like the complete opposite of what you guys do for me. No, it's not gaslighting. It's when you do something bad. <laughs> And you try to convince someone that I didn't do something bad, and that's their fault. Well, this is a form of gaslighting, okay? <laughs> your cupcakes. <laughs> your cupcakes. Your poems. <laughs> Everything you do is as cute as you are. <laughs> Sayori slides up behind Natsuki and puts a hand on her shoulders. Yeah. Natsuki, you write your own poems? Huh? Well, 
I guess sometimes. You can! I think that's impressive. Why don't you show them sometimes? No! Natsuki avoids her eyes. You, you like. Ah, um... oh, not a very confident okay. writer yet. Hmm? That was you. I was okay. running. I understand how Natsuki feels. Sharing that level of writing takes more than just confidence. The truest form of writing is writing to oneself. You must be willing to open up to your readers, exposing your vulnerabilities and showing even the deepest reaches of your heart. Do you have writing experiences too, Yuri? Maybe if you share some of your work, you can set an example to help Natsuki feel comfortable enough to share hers. I mean, if you send it twice, there's a chance people might watch it twice, so that's fine. Yeah. I didn't watch all of these after, <laughs> just to see what the fuck I said. <laughs> yeah. Same. I guess it's the same for Yuri. We all sit in silence for a moment. Okay. Ah. I have a day, everyone. <laughs> Natsuki and Yuri look quizzically at Monaco. The cats are appearing, oh my gosh! Get away! Yeah, same here. Cotton just ran across my keyboard. <laughs> are they just That's all, all having? Huh? Are all of the cats just having a moment right now? I'm eating, and then Toma just appears out of nowhere after I haven't seen him for hours. <laughs> Let's all go home and write a poem of our own. Then next time we meet, we will share them with each other. <laughs> he constantly needs to remind everyone that he's alive, Tashi. By clawing at everything that he does not like. <laughs> that way, everyone is even. He's like, I'm alive and I'm gonna make it your problem. <laughs> yes, he shows violence every time he opens his eyes. <laughs> um, um. Yeah, let's do it! <laughs> I've given up on trying to get a solid voice for Sir for um <laughs> for Sirico. <Miguel>. For Sirico. <laughs> <laughs> Not so me. Plus, now that we have a new member, I think it's it will help us all get a little more comfortable comfortable with each other and strengthen the bond of the club. Maya, get away! This is chocolate. <laughs> Isn't that right, Kenny? Monica smiles warmly at me once again. Hold on, there's still one problem. Huh? What's that? It's me, I'm the problem. Everything I do is a problem, and you all hate me. <laughs> <laughs> now that we're back to the original topic of me joining the club, I bluntly come forth with what's on my mind, with what's been on my mind the entire time. She's on my keyboard! <laughs> Continue. <laughs> <laughs> 99 problems, I'm 98 of them. Yeah, that seems like me. I never said I would join this club. Yeah, see, I told you I was a problem. <laughs> Sayori may have convinced me to stop by, but I never made any decision. Oh, okay. 
iron. I still have other clubs to look at and all. And um I lose my train of thought. All four girls tear back to stare back at me with dejected eyes. I'm not gonna make a comment. <laughs> you don't need to clarify for Rico. It's accurate. But what? I'm sorry, I thought. Wait, <laughs> sorry. Kevin, I'm okay. trying to just. The kitten has woken up and now wants to throw everything down. I'm sorry. Oh, okay. You want to take a short break? No, it's fine. Have... She's not going to fall asleep for a while. Continue. Okay. You all. I'm defenseless against these girls. Ha. How am I supposed to Your make a plan at a decision when it's like this? I kind of like um. Think with your head, Kevin. I kind of like Yuri. Which head? <laughs> that is, if writing poem is a price, if writing poems is a price I have to pay in order to spend every day with these beautiful girls, please tell me I'm not an insult. I'm an insult, aren't I? <laughs> no, you're a neat. What's the difference, right? Okay, I've decided then. I'll join the literature club. Hey. One by one, the girl's eyes light up. Yes! I'm so happy! Sari wraps her arms around me, jumping up and down. Hey. <laughs> you really did scare me for a moment. I'll be super pissed. I'll piss in the cupcakes. Tell I mean, life. that is no. true. But like, yeah, I mean, like, a lot of insults are needs, I guess. But not all needs are insults. Why are you treating hmm. my hand like a choose way? Huh? There how oh, there's so many other things you can be biting right now, come on. Except another one? <laughs> yeah, that's a thing with your head. You really <laughs> Then that makes it official. Welcome to the Legends of Club. Ah, oh. uh, thanks, I guess. Hey, come on, come on, no, no. Okay, everyone. No, no, no. Why are you looking at me like that? No, stop. <laughs> stop. 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 No, don't look at me like that. No. Angels. <laughs> Okay. I need this. A lovely dating experience. Don't look at me like that. So, Chad, how was your day? Okay, yeah, I was thinking if I should do that or not. I think with that, we can officially end today's meeting on a good note. I I actually can't remember the voice that she was using for Monica and the other girls. Everyone, remember tonight's assignment? <clears throat> Write a poem and bring them to the next meeting so we can all share. Monica looks over at me once more. You made art? Send the link. I would need to make a call right oh, okay, now okay. the stream, she's angry. You can still send the link if you'd like. 
<laughs> you dumbass. <laughs> Monica looks at me, looks over at me once more. Kevi, I look forward to seeing. Oh, no. well, go ahead. Kevi, I look forward to seeing how you express yourself. <laughs> You're gonna be horrible. Can I really impress the class star, Monica? With Look my at this vocals? plebeian. Hmm? Look at this plebeian trying to make poetry. Ha! It's gonna be laughable. Yeah, it's gonna be laughable. I can't even read. How oh, you expect me to write? Can I really express impress the star the class star, Monica? With my mediocre writing skills? Tashi, that's what it, that means it's working. I already feel the anxiety welling up inside me. Me and my elder girls continue to chat, to chat, 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 chat. Ch 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 um, ch maybe post it on the Discord. Um, Discord link is probably in the description. But yeah, you can post it there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Don't send the link here, then. Don't get us banned from Twitch. Oh Meanwhile, the girls continue to chit chat as Yuri and Natsuki clean up their food. Hey, Kevin! Since you're already here, do you want to walk home together? That's right, Siri and I never walk home together anymore because she's always stayed after school for clubs. Sure, might as well. With that, the two of us depart the club room and make our way home. The whole way, my mind wanders back and forth between the four games. Sayori, Natsuki, Yuri, and of course, Monica. Will I really be happy spending every day after school in a literature club? Perhaps I'll have the chance to grow closer to one of these girls. Alright, I'll just need to make most the most of my circumstances. I'm sure good fortune will find me. And I guess that's tasked with writing a poem tonight. Okay, write your poem. Let's do it. Ugh, get pumped. Kitchen chocolate charms for graveyard. 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 Nibble, no. destiny, milk, melody, summer, adventure, sticky, neko, memories, excitement. Um. Adventure. Captain, adventure time. Come imaginations. On, cage. Kitty. Games. Kawaii. Inside. Ooh, I would like go. to figure it out on my own. Yay. Mega treasure portrait. Kid. Warm. Defeat. Crimson. Electricity. Existence. Playground. Unrestrained. Faster seems like a horror mood. Uncanny. Yes. Uncontrollable sucks. Incongruent. It what what sucks. does that even mean? What what does that uh, even mean? Incongruent. Yes. Uh, I can't remember. Let's go. Vertigo. 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 <laughs> Sorry, guys. Questioning your your life choices. <laughs> because I want to get the horror girl. I want to get Yuri. Very he explained it, Tashi. I-N-C-O-N-G-U-R-E-N-T. Right, let's see what that word means. Incompatible. Yes, Tashi also said that. He's slow. Death. Massacre. Screw. Ah. <laughs> let's go with Secrets of Phenol. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> love, prayer, tragedy, peace, starscape, proof, love, jumpy bunny, tragedy. Ah, I see, God. I see. We learn big words here. And here. Passion. Passion. 
and sensation anxiety pain. Agonizing. Ag yeah. <laughs> Same brain. Because she likes horror. And they said pick the wood that you think your favorite girl would like, so I'm picking all the horror woods. Afflugan, broken, nature, music, flying, comfort, precious, vivid, dark. Bonzi, sparkle, <laughs> fluffy, vanilla, breed, cheeks. But the soul. Sarika sounds in pain. Yeah. That's how she sounds every time I talk to her. Honestly. Okay. Heaven sent, happiness, friends, entropy, spinning, twill, ambience, silly, rain cloud. Entropy. entropy. That, that's pretty scary. Isn't that a physics thing? Yeah, it is. I don't know much though. Ah, swimsuit. My favorite word. Childhood, amazing, fireworks, disorient, whirlwind, dream, hair, covert, pain. <laughs> He's cheating himself for a woman, don't you understand? Yeah, I'm trying to get the woman. Horror, yes, we want that. Melancholy. Melancholy is such a nice word. It is. But every time I think, every time I say it, I think of a melon and a cauliflower mixed together. A melon. <laughs> a melon and a cauliflower mixed together? Yes. Grief. Yeah. Uh, anger. Rest. God, let's see what the abomination I made. <laughs> Hi, Kevin. Kev's Kelly. Glad to see you didn't run away on us. <laughs> nah, don't worry. This might be a little strange for me, but at least I kept my wood. Injury entropy serves as the organizing and disorganizing principle of the story. It's a lit definition. Oh! Interesting. Okay. Oh, seriously? That's so sad. I really wanted to read that poem. Well, I'm back at the literature club. I was the last to come in, so everyone else is already okay. coming out. Thanks for keeping keep. keep. <clears throat> Thanks for keeping your promise, Gabby. Breathy. I hope this isn't too Death overwhelming thing. of a commitment to for you. Oh no, lady! If it's for you, I can commit. <laughs> Making you dive headfirst into literature when you're not accustomed to it. I would dive headfirst into anything. <laughs> Is there any slack? <clears throat> I have chocolate in your mouth. As Sorry. you <laughs> told me you didn't even want to join any clubs this year. Yeah, because I'm lazy. La I'm last year too. I don't know if you plan to just come here and hang out or what. But if you don't take us seriously, then you won't see the end of it. Tom. She's not taking your crap. <laughs> oh no, the short girl is angry with me. <laughs> She'll kick her shins, <laughs> don't run the rest of them. <laughs> that's, that's okay, you certainly have a big mouth for some- Wait, no, that's you. Wait, no, that's me. Yeah, that's, that's you. Okay. You certainly have a big mouth for someone who keeps her manga collection in the classroom. But, <laughs> <laughs> you sound like someone just punched you in the gut. Natsuki finds herself stuck between saying Monica and Manga. Manga is literature! Swiftly defeated, Natsuki plops back into her seat. Don't worry, guys. Kelly always gives it to his 
as long as he's having fun. Yeah, exactly. He helps me with busy work without me even asking because I've told him multiple times before to do it because I keep telling him to do it. <laughs> but I'm always there playing video games and reading manga. <laughs> Like cooking, cleaning my room. Do I at least get paid for that? How defendable. How is you? Yeah, that yeah, that's me. How defendable. Well, no, no. Sir, that's because your room is so messy it's distracting. And you almost set your house on fire once. Is that <laughs> you two are really good friends, aren't you? I might be a little jealous. Hmm. You and Kevin you can become good friends too. Yeah, I feel like I always end up complaining about how messy your room is when I come over. Mm. Maybe I should just spray like a broom and a scoop and a mop and just start cleaning my come over next time. <laughs> I'll dress up in a maid outfit. Yes. You know, like that scene where Levi was in the maid suit? <laughs> <laughs> um... Sayori? Huh? As usual, Sayori seems oblivious to the weird situation she just put me into. I'm also kind of oblivious, what happened? brought you something today, you know? Uh, wait, Sayori? Oh. Uh, me? Um, not really. Hi. It's really nothing. I think she does. It's because of my poem that I wrote her. <laughs> I what is it? Pause for a second. Never mind. Sayori made it sound like a big deal, but it's really not. Uh, what do I do? Eh? I'm sorry, Yuri. I wasn't thinking. I'm sorry. I guess it's up to me to rescue this situation. Oh, she's blushing. <laughs> hey, don't worry about it. First of all, I wasn't expecting anything in the first place. So any nice gesture from you is a pleasant surprise. It'll make me happy no matter what. Is that so? <clears throat> yeah, I wouldn't make it make it a big deal if you don't want it to be. Alright. Well, yeah. Yuri reaches into her bag and pulls out a book. I didn't want you to feel left out. So I picked out a book that I thought you might enjoy. It's a short read, so it should keep your attention. Even if you because don't Because you can't it. read. It's yeah, the alphabet. Exactly. <laughs> it's a pronunciation and vowels book. And we hmm. could, you know. Yes, I'm gonna try that next. Discuss it, if you want to. But this is... Oh wait, I was still in character. How is this girl accidentally being so cute? She even picked out a book she thinks I'll like, despite me not reading much. Yuri, thank you. I'll definitely read this. I enthusiastically take the book. Hey. Well, you can read it at your own pace. I'll look forward to hearing what you think. Now that everyone's settled in, I expected Monica to kick off some scheduled activities for the club. But that doesn't seem to be the case. Sayori and Monica are having a cherry conversation in the corner. Yuri's face is already buried in the book. I can't help but notice how intense her expression. Her intense expression. Like she was waiting for this chance. Meanwhile, Natsuki is running around in the closet. <laughs> oh, I hope you guys didn't hear that. What was it? Was it a boo? Yeah, it was a boo. I tried to like <laughs> cover my mouth and hide it. It's horrible. It, it was like one of those throaty boobs, you know? One. Oh no. Yeah. But no, it was a one. Oh, that's not good. 
Mm. Gonna try to meet myself like in time next time. Hmm? It's not like a door creaking. Oh well, it's not. It's not. A bit, it was a door creaking. Might hmm. someone just open my door? Hmm. Oh no, I'm so oh, heartbroken. Yeah. Wow. Is this all it took? I'm really curious to talk to Yuri a little bit more. But at the same time, I would feel bad for distracting her from reading. I catch a glimpse of the cover of her book. It looks like the same book that she lent to me. More than that, she seemed to be on the first few pages. Ah, uh, crap. I think she notices me looking at her. She sneaks another glance at me, <laughs> and our eyes meet for a split second. But that only makes her hide her face deeper into the book. Sorry. I was just spacing out. I muttered us, sensing I made her uncomfortable. Oh. It's fine. If I was focused, then... If I was focused, then I probably wouldn't have noticed in the first place. But I'm just rereading a bit of this, so... That's the book you gave me, right? Mm-hmm. I wanted to reread some of it. Not for any particular reason. Just curious, how come you have two copies of the same book? Ah. Oh. Well, when I stopped at the book... <clears throat> well, when I stopped at the book yesterday, the bookstore yesterday... Yeah. That's not what I meant. I mean, I just happened to buy two of them. Ah, I see. There's something fairly obvious here that Yuri isn't telling me, but I decide to let it go. <laughs> I'll definitely start reading it soon. I'm glad to hear. Once it starts to pick up, you might have a hard time putting it down. It's a very engaging and relatable story. Is that so? What's it about anyway? <laughs> well... Hmm? Yuri closes the book and scans her eyes over the book. The book is titled Portrait of Marco. Her eyes in a printer. <laughs> There's an ominous looking eye symbol on the front cover. Alright. I just wanted to make sure I didn't I don't accidentally give anything away. Basically, it's about this girl in high school who moves in with her lost her long lost younger sister. But as soon as she does so, her life gets real. <laughs> a third wall, fourth wall. Yes, yeah, the fourth wall. She gets targeted by one of these people who escaped from a human experiment prison. And while her life is in danger, she needs to desperately choose who to trust. No matter what she does, she ends up destroying most of her relationships, and her life starts to fall apart. That's kind of. That's kind of dark, isn't it? Yuri made it sound like it was going to be a nice story. So that dark turn came from nowhere. <laughs> it's a wonderful story. So many people die. Oh my god. It's yeah, amazing. I like those are like the best kinds of stories. <laughs> Yuri gently gently giggles all of a sudden. Are you not a fan of this kind of thing, Kavi? No, it's not that. I mean I can definitely enjoy these kind of stories, so don't worry. I hope so. Yeah, I totally forgot that Yuri is into those things. We literally wrote a so, poem about that last night. Also, uh, these desks are way too clean to be in a school. Agreed. There'll be so many dicks on the if, if it were my school. Gum, so many drawings. Somebody yeah, just be dicks. scratching at the desk. Mm -hmm. There'll be like dicks everywhere. All on the walls, everywhere. on the desk, on the chairs. Still Japan. I'm sure they draw manga or some shit on their dress. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised. Isn't that like racist or stereotypical or something? No, scribbling is a human trait. You cannot be a human if you don't scribble on desks. <laughs> <laughs> At least once in your life. <laughs> true, true. She's so shy and reclusive on the outside, but her mind seems to be completely different. It's just that those kinds of stories, they challenge you to look at life from a strange new perspective. 
When horrible things happen, it's not just because someone wants to be evil, but because they have their own goal and their own philosophy that they believe in. Then suddenly, when you thought you related to the protagonist, they made out to be the naive one for letting their one-sided morals interfere with the, with the villain's plans. I'm... I'm rambling, aren't I? Not again. That, that I'm sorry. The scribbles... You I mean, scribbled a dick on the teacher's dick once? <laughs> That's like... Um... Should I call like CPS Child or something? <laughs> I mean, I don't remember the shops had a show with it. Not only the teachers. That's still a scribble. It How does... do you even scribble a dick on a teacher's dick? <laughs> no, no, we're not waiting. <laughs> <laughs> what are we gonna wait on? Waiting on what? A picture? I don't wanna see that. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna call the police now. I don't want proof. I believe you. Don't worry. I believe you. Yeah, we're gonna talk to the school board as soon as I'm done with the stream. Uh huh, the teacher's desk. Uh huh, uh huh. Nice save. <laughs> uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. We're gonna go around inspecting teacher's desk now. <laughs> I'm gonna make a Tinder account. I'm sorry. I don't know. Just don't. Hey, don't apologize. I haven't lost interest or anything. Well, I guess it's alright then. But I feel like I should let you know that I have this problem. When I let things like books and writing fill my thoughts, I kind of forget to pay attention to other people. So I'm sorry if I end up saying something strange. And please stop me if I start talking too much. That... I really don't think you need to worry. That just means you're passionate about reading. The least I can do is listen. It's a literature club after all. Uh, <clears throat> that's... Well, that's true. In fact, I might as well get started reading it, right? You don't have to. Ah, uh, ha, what are you saying? Just a moment ago, you said you were looking forward to it. Let me just get the book. I quickly retrieved the book that I had put into my bag. Alright, it's fine if I sit here, right? I slip into the seat next to Yuri's. Uh, yeah? Are you sure? You seem a little apprehensive. What? I'm sorry. It's that I didn't... It's not that I don't want you to. It's just something I'm not very used to. That is, reading in company with someone. I see. Well, just tell me if I end up distracting you or anything. Alright. I open the book and start the prologue. I soon understand what Yuri means about reading in company. It's as if I can feel my presence over her shoulder as I read. My presence over my shoulder. Her presence over <laughs> my shoulder. <laughs> it's like an out of body experience. Out of body. <laughs> it's like if I'm astral projecting to myself. I could do literally anything that I choose to watch myself read. It's not particularly a bad thing. Maybe a little distracting, but the feeling is somewhat confusing. Yuri is in the corner of my eye. I realize that she's not actually looking at her own book. I glance over. It looks like she's reading from my book instead. Sorry. That's kinda creepy, bro. No. I would be creeped about? out. I don't know what you're talking about. I would be creeped out. I don't know what you're talking about. Why? <laughs> no, don't worry about it. Um, Sorry. I was just... You, you really apologize a lot, don't you? I do. I don't really mean to. Sorry. I mean... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this should work, right? I slide my desk up until it's against Yuri's. Then hold my book more between the two of them. 
stop? I suppose so. Yuri timidly closes her own copy. Once for each lean on the butt. Hello, Mel Professor. It's been so long. Mm -hmm. Professor! How are you? I started playing other games as well. I did Night in the Woods and I just started Doki Doki Literature Club like today. Things, Mel Professor. You're going to be hearing a lot more of my beautiful voice. And I've got a whoop on call with you right now. Hello, I am Whoop. She's a goblin. She's a goblin. I am. I'm in I am not in goblin position right now, but I assume will be. Assume the position. It is done. Good, good, good. <laughs> Once we each lean in a little bit, our shoulders are almost touching. It feels like my left arm is in the way, so I use my right arm to hold the book open. Uh, I guess that makes it kind of difficult to turn the page. Yeah. Yuri takes her left arm and holds the left side of the book between her thumb and forefinger. Teamwork. Yes. And I also have a Twitter. We bothered him to do more things. Mm -hmm. uh, I do the same with my right arm on the right side of the book. That way, I turn the page and Yuri slides it under her thumb after it flips to her side. But in holding it like this, we're huddled even closer than before. It's actually kind of distracting me. It's as if I can feel the warmth of Yuri's face. And she's in the corner of my vision. You see underneath those desks? There are no scribbles. These people are fake. There are no dicks. <laughs> there are no dicks. How disappointing. Are you ready? Ah? Uh, to turn the page. Ah, oh, sorry. I think I got a bit distracted for a second. I glance over at Yuri's face again, and our eyes meet. I don't know how I'll be able to keep up with her. Ah, uh, that's okay. You're not used. You're not used to reading, right? I don't mind being patient if it takes you a bit longer. My heart. <laughs> it's probably the least I can do. Since you've been so patient with me. Yeah. Thanks. Oh yeah. We no. continue reading. Yeah. Kevin doesn't know about this game, so don't say sh don't. Yeah, I know absolutely nothing about this game. I just know, like, Somehow. the tags and the content warning from the start. But other than that, yes. no. Nothing. Somehow he doesn't. I don't understand how. I am very good at avoiding spoilers. Mm. Yuri no longer asks me if I'm ready to turn the page. Instead, I just assume that she finishes the page before me. So I turn it by my own volition. Um, can I delete that message? I'll try to delete the message. How do you delete you messages? I don't know if you can. Oh, that sucks. I'm gonna try. Instead, I just assume that you finished the page. Okay. We continue the first chapter in silence. Even so, turning each page almost feels like an intimate exchange. My thumb. Oh, you should get it. Most likely, yes. It's. I think it's like really good to chat with. My thumb gently letting go of the page. Yeah, that seems like a very good idea. Letting it flutter over to her side as she catches it under her own thumb. Okay, I will do that. You're such a good, like, manager, I guess. Manager? <laughs> yeah. Hey, Yuri. This might be a silly thought, but... The main character kind of reminds me of you a little bit. I think so? How does she? Well, I guess she's more blunt in a lot of ways. But she also second guesses all of the things that she says and does. Like she's afraid she'll do something wrong. 
It's not like I can see into your head or anything. But they're kind of reminiscent of you, of some of your mannerisms. Uh, I see. Yuri remains silent for a moment. But Kavi, that's probably a terrible thing to have in common with her. Uh, this is so embarrassing that you think that. Wait, I didn't mean this in a bad way or anything. Sorry, I didn't. I really didn't know if you were self-conscious about that sort of thing. I guess I more meant that it's kind of cute. Uh, uh, <clears throat> what are you saying all of a sudden? Uh, we'll pure. Oh, yeah. She doesn't have the uh. Uh. Okay, everyone. Okay, everyone. I think it's about time we share today's poems with each other. Wait, what's the English voice song like again? Like Hermione. Uh, Hermione, Hermione, Hermione. We might not have enough time if we, <laughs> if we wait too long. <laughs> uh, Yuri exhales, paired from finishing her thoughts. Is that right? Is that all right? Is that all right, Yuri? <laughs> you, look, you look kind of down. He's gonna make way more reading than he's expecting, indeed. I'm sorry if you haven't been looking forward to this. Uh, it's not. It's fine. Yeah, I was gonna say that. That it's funny that I'm pursuing Yuri while I'm acting, huh? Yeah, I'm gonna do that. That means you like yourself more. Hmm? That means he likes yourself more. Yeah, I love myself. <laughs> Yuri releases her hand from the book, causing it to close on top of my tongue. Ow. Alright. I guess I'll do some more reading tonight. Or would you prefer if I only read it with you? Um. I guess I don't have too much of a preference either way. Hmm. In that case, I'll read a little more tonight. I think it'll be more fun to read with you after it picks up a bit, you know? That's good reasoning. In that case, feel free to finish the first two chapters on your own time. Alright. I stand up. Alright! I make a mental note of where I left off in the book, and then slip it back into my bag. Did you remember to write a poem last night? Y yeah. My relaxation ends. I can't believe I agreed to do something so embarrassing. I couldn't really find much inspiration, since I've never really done this before. Well, now that everyone's ready, why don't you find someone to share it with? Oh, sorry. This is Monica Kevin. I'm sorry, I sound like a mannequin. <laughs> well, <laughs> now that everyone's ready, why don't we find someone to share with? I was literally reading Shadow Key. <laughs> I can't wait! I can't wait! Sayori and Monica enthusiastically pulls out their poems. Sayori is on a wrinkled sheet. That look of loose leaf from a torn spiral notebook. On the other hand, Monica wrote hers in a composition notebook. I can already see Monica's pristine handwriting from where I sit. Natsuki and Yuri reluctantly comply as well, reaching into their bags. Oh, that's whoop. Me! I'm whoop! She's helping with voice acting since I'm suck at it. Indeed, doodle. And she's also trying to coach me since I suck at it. Only a little bit. Just so I won't suck at it. Tiny bit. Just a tiny bit. You need to throw away your shame. Yeah, I do. <laughs> yes, also because she's fun. I'm incredibly fun. I'm so fun. Oh my gosh. Yeah, all of the clips we have today is because of her. A lot. I do the same myself. 
Who should I show my poem to first? Yuri. Who do you want to show? A <laughs> okay. Yuri seems the most experienced, so I should start with her. I can trust her opinion, to be fair. I literally spent all day with Yuri so far. It'll be weird if I didn't. Yes. As Yuri reads the poem, I notice her eyes lighten. Exception. Exceptional. Huh? What was that? Did I say that out loud? Yuri first covers her mouth, but then ends up covering her whole face. I. He wrote this exactly to the taste. How could she? <laughs> exactly. Not? I did my research. <laughs> As I should the sus. <laughs> um. You really didn't do anything wrong, Yuri. Huh? That's. I guess you're right. What am I getting nervous, so nervous for? <laughs> Yuri it's takes a brush. She's crushing so hard right now. So? I'm not crushing this room. What kind of experience, writing experience do you have? Your use of imagine, your, your use of Im imagery and metaphors indicates you've written a lot of poetry before. Really? Well, that's a huge compliment coming from you. This is actually my first time, really. I wish Damn. I was good things on my first time. Huh? Save! Oh, right. Thank you. Yuri stares at me blankly, then looks at my poem again. Well, I know that. I just meant, um... Yuri trails off, unable to find an excuse. She traces her finger along the words in the poem, as if breaking it down more thoroughly. Yeah. Okay. This is the reason I was able to tell. It's just that there are specific habits that are usually typical of new writers. And having been through that myself, I kind of learned to pick up on them. I think the most noticeable thing I recognize in new writers is that they try to make their style very deliberate. In other words, they tend to pick a writing style separate from the topic matter and they form fit the two together. The end result is that both the style and the expressiveness are weakened. Once you refine the train of thought, it's as if her demeanor totally changes. Her stammering is completely gone and she sounds like an expert. Of course, that's not something you can be blamed for. There are so many different skills and techniques that go into writing even a simple poem. Not just finding them, building them, but getting them to work together is probably the most challenging part. It might take you some time, but it all comes with practice and learning by example, trying new things. I also hope that everyone else in the club gives you valuable feedback. Not sicky can be a bit based though. Based how? Um, well, never mind. I shouldn't be talking about people like that. Sorry, it's fine. Not sure talking if you're behind people problem. back. Hmm? Huh. Talking behind people back. Yeah, one man, yes. <laughs> Probably shouldn't say <laughs> that. <again>. Huh? <laughs> hmm. Not sure it's a joke. Up. It's a joke, I swear. <laughs> yeah, it's I swear it's a joke. Don't cancel me. It's just a prank, I swear. Yeah, there's a camera. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not sure if you is apologizing. Do you mind if I read you, if I read your poem now? Please do. I'd love to share my thought process behind it. Yuri smells dreamy. As as if that's a rare opportunity to go for her. Which itself is kind of funny. After all, isn't this supposed to be a literature club? Ghost Under the Light 
I'll try to read the Tanyuri's voice. Ghost under the light. The tendrils of my hair illuminate. Breath. Breathe the amber glow. I cannot read the cursive. Let me just read through it quick and then I'll read the back. Ghost under the light. The, tra the tendrils of my hair illuminate beneath the amber bathing. It must be this one. The last remaining street light to have withstood the test of time. The last yet to be replaced by the sickening blue green hue of the future. I bathe. Come. You want, you want me to read the cursive? Yes, you read the cursive. <laughs> Ghost under the light. The tendrils of my hair illuminate beneath the amber glow. Bathing. It must be this one. The last remaining remaining streetlight to have withstood the test of time. The last yet to be replaced by the sickening green hue of the future. I bathe, calm, breathing air of the present but living in the past. The light flickers, I flicker back. Ah, oh, wistful there, so on so forth. My dogs are very talkative right now. I'm gonna put them inside, I'll be back in one second. Very talkative. Kevin. He is very quiet. Uh, Kevin is putting his dogs back in wherever they were at the beginning. I just got food. There are cats everywhere, and I read the thing because Kevin couldn't read cursive. Oh, this game, currently we are in a literature club. Currently we are in a literature club. Uh, his childhood friend just got him to join with bribery of cupcakes from some girl in the club. And he's crushing on this purple-haired girl. And they have to read their poems that they had made last night. Hello, Cameron. Hey, Sophia. I'm back. No, you were unmuted. <laughs> no, I was unmuted on Discord, but I wasn't ah, muted on. Sense. Yeah. That makes sense. That makes sense. Yeah. So where were we? Um, I was reading Yuri's poem. Well, you were reading Yuri's poem for me. Yes, indeed. I think I did a marvelous job. I still didn't unmute myself. Wow. <laughs> so I was just talking, like if I had myself unmuted, but I wasn't. Anyway, I'm back. Hello everyone. Uh, what? I wasn't thinking that at all. I, I, I'm lost. <laughs> but it took you a longer time to read. Ah. Uh, well, I just don't read script very often. I actually think your handwriting is pretty. Huh? That's a relief. Also, I like the poem. Even though it's short, it was really descriptive. It wasn't too short? No, I think it was average. I usually write It was, it was pretty average. I've read better. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Not at all. I'm really glad you like it. I'll be honest. Since it's our first time sharing, I wanted to write something a little more mild. Something easy to digest, I suppose. It was short because he can't read. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Are, you, are you into ghost, Yuri? 
Actually, the story isn't about a ghost at all, Cabby. Really? I must have totally missed the point. Well, I suppose you did. Only get glance over it, after all. But remember that poets often express their own thoughts, feelings, and experiences in their work. They usually do more than tell a simple story or paint a picture. I'm I'm trying to huddle up as close to the mic as possible. <laughs> Let's the mic. finish this. The mic is in the laptop. <laughs> I'll send you a link of to a cheap mic on Amazon. Okay, that would be nice. If I find them. Yes. Lingering in her last remaining places of comfort, unable to let go of the past, and soon to be left with nothing. That's a lot more solemn, putting it that way. I hadn't I hadn't even thought of that. That's impressive. Huh? It's, it's nothing really. Yours was impressive too, so... That's something I don't hear every day. Nah. If anything, I could probably <clears throat> learn a thing or two from you. You think so? Yeah, of course. Uh, you know... I was really nervous about doing all, all this. But in the end, I enjoyed it. I'm going to keep my best for you, Kevin. Oh, that's so sweet. Okay, I might, I'll be done in like 15 minutes, so like, yeah. I don't think you'll be back in time. Bye bye though, have fun. Enjoy your dinner Bye. and movie. Bye, Sergan. Ah, me too. Who should I show my poem to next? Sayori. Poem go, Kevi. Are you sure it's your first time? Oh, uh, I skipped for a second. Hmm. It's not that I good. Am I the kind of guy who would be writing poems in his spare time? <laughs> yes, you're right. <laughs> you're boring like that. <laughs> you're not an artist. But that's why I'm impressed. You that's should why be I'm impressed. impressed. <laughs> huh? You should be impressed. <laughs> I think I'm echoing on your oh. side. What? Oh, I don't know. It's cause you're loud, probably. Yeah, oh, cause, no. I'm, cause yeah. I'm loud. Nice. Well, to be honest, not that great. I was afraid you wouldn't do it seriously. I did it seriously for the blue haired pretty girl, okay? Don't be flattered. Not for you. <laughs> not everything's about you. Yeah. But I think... Or that you wouldn't, or that you wouldn't write one at all. Okay, maybe that is very like me, but still. <laughs> I'm really happy that you wrote one. It just reminds me of how you're really a good part of the club now. A really part of the club now that I bribed you with. Ha! My <laughs> trick worked. Not to mention the fact that I'm standing in front of you in the club room. Uh, well, of course. I'm not really into it as yet, but that doesn't mean I'll break my promise. I would make a mockery of her art. You see? It's like I said before, Kenny. Deep down, like really deep down, under those onion layers, there's not so selfish after- <laughs> You're not that selfish at all, you know? Huh, that's disappointing. I really wish I was that selfish. Hmm. 
trying new things like this is for other people. You're trying new things for this for other people. <laughs> you fucked it up twice, but that's fine. Yes, shush, shush, it's fine. I'm eating fries right now, okay? Oh, really? I want fries. <laughs> you live in the best life. I can of smell course. fries, but I don't have fries. <laughs> That's something that only really good people do. I'm blowing the the my the fry sauce, fry sauce, the fry, fry sauce sense into the microphone. What kind of sauce do you like on your fries? Thanks, Sayori. Right now, I have ketchup, mustard, and garlic sauce. No pepper sauce. Nah, not right now. Oh, ketchup, mustard, and garlic sauce is the best. Mm. Oh hell yeah. I'm down for those hot dog creams. <laughs> yeah. We can set up the camera and all. And uh, we can put some bubbles in it. I, I vibe mm. with that. <laughs> I'm not sure if Sayori sees the full picture of my motive here. Then again, I can't deny that she's part of the reason I joined. Knowing how much this means to her and all. Yeah. Bubbles. Yes, bubbles. Did you hear the man? I said what I said. <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna make sure that you have lots of fun here, okay? Whether I like it or not. Whether you like it or not, because you're my prisoner! <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I'm so scared. <laughs> that, would, that would be my way of thanking you. Not sure if I should feel threatened or not. You want to treat dog? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'm going to hold you to that one. No, you're, you're not supposed to agree. You're a prisoner. Yay! You read my poem too, right? Don't worry, I'm really bad at this. We'll see about that. Dear sunshine, the way you glow through my blinds in the morning, it makes me feel like you miss me. Kissing my forehead to help me out of bed, making me rub my sleepy, my sleepy, the, the sleepy, sleepy. <laughs> my sleepy from my eyes, <laughs> making me rub the sleepy from my eyes. Are you asking me to come out and play? Are you trusting me to wish you a rainy day? I look, look above, the sky is blue. It's a secret, but I trust you too. If it, weren't for, if it wasn't for you, I could sleep forever. But I'm not mad, I want breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, more Professor. Uh, it's been nice oh, having you here. Know. Um, you know the time. 7 to 9 p.m. Daily, Monday to Friday. No stream on weekends. I look forward to seeing you, and yeah, see you in the next one. Don't forget my Twitter on Discord, you can join whenever you create one. We can chat or stream and whatnot. Oh my gosh, you can have a friend. Nelly. Yes, a friend. Sayori. This is just a guess, but... Did you wait until morning to write this? No. Oh. I'm perfect at time management. Just a little bit. You can't answer just a little bit to a yes or no question. I forgot to do it last night. Well, at least that makes me feel a little better about myself. You were worried that I wouldn't do it at all. Oh, I would half ass it. And yet here you are, not doing it when you should. I'm eating. <laughs> oh, not you. I'm, I'm talking to the... I'd never rush you. No, that no. seems rude. I'm not a rude boy. I'm a good boy. Hmm. <laughs> Debatable. Don't be mean! <laughs> I still tried my best. Ah, uh, yeah. I didn't mean to say it was a bad one. 
it just came out nice. Or how should I put it? It sounds just like you. Is the yampi really in my eyes? Like still? <laughs> you went to school for the entire day with yampi in your eyes. You should feel ashamed. Yep. <laughs> but once again, I am not. I'm not surprised. I'm not surprised! Every day you find new ways to disappoint me. <laughs> the ways you disappoint me. You ha I have nine my pro 99 problems. And all of them are you. <laughs> One of them may be me, but mostly you. Yeah. Especially that last line. I made eggs and toast. Oh, I had eggs and hash brown this morning, and it was lovely. I have eggs and hash brown every morning, and it's lovely. Eggs and hash brown are like my favorite breakfast. I remember what I had. The first thing I ate today was... pak soup. <laughs> huh. Yeah, that seems because I wanted soup. I have some ramen in the, in the cupboard, and I'm tempted to have it, but I've had ramen for like the past four days. And that's not very healthy. Not very healthy at all, no. Even though you were late for school? <laughs> I had to skip breakfast. It's yeah, hash browns to skip breakfast. are a mood. Huh? Tashi, hash browns are a mood. Oh, that's nice, that's nice. That's less nice. Like spread and cheese. Hmm. Fry. Hello, Cool Kids Fry. Club. How are you? Welcome to my stream. I hope you enjoy yourself. And yeah, Tashi, do your work and post my links because that would be nice. If you like the stream, you would probably like chatting with me on my Discord. Uh, Whoop is there as well. Hello. Greetings. <laughs> uh, huh. Bad soup? That seems a bit racist. No? Soup, huh? You also deny that message. Creative. It's bad to skip. <laughs> yeah, sure. very creative. Yeah, skipping breakfast is pretty bad. Mm. I'm cranky. Well, I guess there's no point in arguing. Anyway, thanks for showing me. Um, I I'm. Good to know. Yes. This is good to know. Actually, this is skipping so much breakfast. Fun. Huh? Ah, never mind, you continue. No, that was it. Oh. <laughs> Monica's the best! Ah, uh, yeah. <laughs> but next time, I won't forget. Good. Made fun of me thinking I was gonna forget. Because you always forget. You're horrible. You're disgusting. Maybe that is true. The best poem ever. Maybe that's huh? true, but like, do you really have the right to say that? Do you really have the right to call me out on my awfulness? Huh? Look, do as I say, not as I do, and I what I say is right. I think her voice acting is very good. It's very entertaining. Yeah. I mean, if you don't like it, you can leave. Good to know. I respect your opinion, good, <laughs> good sir. Yeah, she respects your opinion, but she's not Continue. going to comply. I'm not gonna listen to it. <laughs> yeah. Well, I guess I'm I look forward comply. to it. Continue. Who should, Monica I should and show... Let's do this. Yeah, and we'll save Monica for last. Damn. Okay, Paimon. <clears throat> Go on. I got, I got this. Hubby, if you're not going to take this club seriously, then go home! 
Hey, I did my homework last night, okay? Unlike some members. Uh, how do I ban people from chat? Uh, I'm just glad that I convinced this guy that I'm from Asia. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty hilarious. I convinced him so good. Oh my oh, god. Thank you, Sashi. You're doing work. Good job. I convinced him. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> he he seems dumb. So confidence. <laughs> huh. First racist. Nice. Nice. We get a milestone. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Yay. Oh, and also Yay. first plan. Bang. First plan. <laughs> oh, we were just like farming him for content. <laughs> I was just farming. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta be on that grind, you know? Indeed, you do know. Then he's gonna bad talk me. And <laughs> people are gonna come to me. And it's gonna be so good. Indeed, it's just it's so much fun to talk to people who are so confident in what they say and are so wrong. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like I don't know, if, like I just like huh? paused every time I saw him say something. I was like, this guy's a troll, obviously. <laughs> well, yeah, but it was funny, huh? Uh huh. Uh huh. <laughs> Hush. Will you expect me to believe that you actually put effort into this? Yeah. No, maybe. I just chose <laughs> random words that I thought a single person less would like. Less confident in your answers. Hmm? Less and less confident in your answers. <laughs> yeah. I just chose random words that I thought a cute girl would like. Yeah. If you think it's low effort, then maybe it wasn't for you, obviously. Burn. <laughs> Do you think I'm stupid? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not a writer. <laughs> Maybe that's not very good. But yeah, I did put an effort. We'll, we'll start somewhere, I'm right? Because it's nine o'clock. Uh, I feel like we're almost done with this day, so. Yeah. As soon as we're done, I'm gonna end the stream. We'll start cool. somewhere, right? Started from the bottom, now we're here. <laughs> <laughs> if you're still proud of the sure. first poem you ever wrote, then I'd like to read it. Her eyes are so far apart. Oh my gosh, they are. They're very far apart. Oh no. Oh Painful no. to think about. <laughs> it's just more space for brain <laughs> Oh no, my girl, what did they ever do to you? <laughs> Fine. Fine. <laughs> well, sorry. <laughs> well, sorry. <laughs> You'll get better anyway. Another clip. Good. Right. <clears throat> I'll tell you what to improve, but you're better off just trying again. Rude. <laughs> Fair enough. Well, to each their own, I guess. Anyway, I guess I gotta share mine now. <laughs> Knowing you, you'll pro you'll probably think it's stupid. <laughs> can fly. Monkeys can climb. Crickets can leap. Horses can't race, owls can seek, cheetahs can run, eagles can fly, people can try, and that's about it. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. I'm pretty sure there's more than one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, this is very creative. Animals. So creative. I love this. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Clap, clap. She can Snap. like list all of my all of the animals. And all of your talents. Um, look, could never. Yeah, I told you that you weren't gonna like it. I loved it. Z <laughs> zebra, <laughs> zebra. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> I'm going to go zebra. This is zebra. Zebra. I like it. No, I don't. I hate it. Really, it's not horrible. just. I've never seen something so horrible in my yeah. life. Oh my gosh. I thought the space between your two eyes was terrible, but this plum was even worse. <laughs> The eagle can fit between your eyes. <laughs> the horse can fit between the eyes. <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Too far. Uh, yeah, I think that's a bit far, no? <laughs> Just be honest. I am. Um... Go live in the closet with you. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe she is in the closet, Tashi. You don't know. Yeah, you, you don't, don't know, know her life. Yeah. <laughs> you remember how it felt when you were in the closet? Huh? Why are you so convinced that I wouldn't like it? Oh. Because. You have horrible judgment. Everyone <laughs> in high school thinks that writing has to be all sophisticated and stuff. So people don't even take my writing seriously. <laughs> that is the most exactly. bold face that I have ever seen in my life. Oh my god. Oh no no no, Bob, she's right, she's right, she's straight. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Okay, I take the internet as that. Okay, let's do this. <laughs> but isn't the point of poems for people to express themselves? Your writing style wouldn't make your message any less valid. Yes, exactly! People can try, it's right in the poem! <laughs> like, when it's easy to read, but it hits you hard. Like a truck? Like a truck. <laughs> like in this poem. Literally nothing in this poem slaps. <laughs> People can try. <laughs> Big dabs. <laughs> See? Everyone around you do great things can be really disheartening. That's why I surround myself with losers. <laughs> Guilty by association. <laughs> so I decided to write about it. Yeah, I understand. But the other nice thing about simple writing is that it puts more weight on the wordplay. God smiles, she's so smug. You're like 12, what do you know about wordplay? <laughs> like, I set up for a rhyme in the, the end, but then made it fall flat on purpose. And I am amazing! Oh my god! Yes. Well, when you're pretty like me, all you want to be surrounded by Amaro's Tashi. It helps bring out the feeling in the last line. So you did. I guess more went in than to it than I realized. That's what it means to be a pro. Huh. I'm going to dip my dick in balls and paint it on a white canvas and... <laughs> no! <laughs> and call it art. No! <laughs> it's just gonna have a few pairs in it. <laughs> I'm glad you learned something. I didn't learn anything. <laughs> no, it's right in the poem. People can try. Eagles can fly. Horses can run. Tree Jesus dogs can, can run. walk and run at the same time. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't expect that from the youngest one here, did you? <laughs> no, I got what I expected. Yeah, I guess not. I decided to humor her with that last comment. I don't really care how well everyone is, but if that's the is feeling proud, then I wouldn't take that away from her. That's what a pedophile says. <laughs> Hi, Kevy. Hi, Kevy. Hi, Kevy. <laughs> Hi, Monica. My voice, my voice cracked again. Hi, Monica. <laughs> Hi, Monica. Having a good time so far? 
Yes, Monica. <laughs> <laughs> Good, glad to hear it. Thank She's you, like a you know the cherry cap <laughs> Yeah. Oh wait, since you're new and everything. If you ever have any suggestions for the club, like new activity or things you can do better, <laughs> you can do better. Maybe that's what I want to be. <laughs> Yay, go team! Woo! I'm always listening. <laughs> I, <laughs> I keep defaulting to a white mom. <laughs> Don't be afraid to, be, to bring things up, okay? Well, maybe that's what Wob wants to be. Alright, I'll keep that in mind. Cause I'll be afraid to bring things up and you can't convince me otherwise. <laughs> I'm much I'll better you off. All of you are horrible. Natsuki, you're first. <laughs> <laughs> I'm much better off just going with, uh, with the flow until I'm all settled in. Mm. Wanna share your poem with me? It's kind of embarrassing, but I guess I have to. Oh. Your voice cracks as well, I see. <laughs> Dolphin. What was that? <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, Kevin. You know the the club music the club music that people play? I think so. <laughs> you just sounded like like club music. Nice. You know, but it's that sort, of, that sort of barrier, and we'll all learn to get past him. Not me, fam. Not me. Yeah, okay. that's true. <laughs> this is how life is. I hand Monica my poem. <laughs> mm. Mm. Great job, Kevy. <laughs> Great job, Kevy. I was going, I was going oh in my head while reading it. Huh, sus. It's really metaphorical. I'm not sure why, but I don't expect you to go for something so deep. That's me, baby. Deep in <laughs> that <laughs> I guess I underestimated you. It's easiest for me to keep everyone's expectation low. <laughs> That's fair. I think I've heard you say that before. Yeah. Always make everyone not expect you to be good at any time. So you can put Except a minimal unexpected. effort. Yeah, so you can put a minimal effort and everyone will be happy with you. Um, you do no, no. That way is always content, but exactly. Very fair. It doesn't have to be. Neither is life, okay? Life isn't fair. <laughs> Grow up. Exactly. Well, I guess it worked anyway. Well, well, I guess it worked anyways. You know, Larry likes this kind of writing, right? You know, Larry likes this kind of writing, right? <laughs> uh huh, she told me. She read it first. She told me. I I read her Facebook. I went to her Instagram. I scrolled through that shit. Yeah. <laughs> Don't ask me. I did my research before writing this one. That's very specific. Specific. That's to this. very specific. <laughs> writing writing that's full of imagery. Some some. I like oh, Sayori. Sorry. Unlike Sayori, who likes using simple and direct words to describe happiness and sadness. Yuri likes it when readers are left to derive their own meaning out of it. Huh. Of it. Yes. I'm very chal- It's very challenging to write like that, effectively. Effectively. Help you! <laughs> Both allowing people to get something out of it, just by feel. We're talking about poems, right? Yes. Okay. Letting them deeply analyze all of the nuances and crevices. <laughs> <laughs> it can take years of practice, which I'm assuming Yuri has at least at this point. Which I'm assuming Yuri has at this point. I never really asked though. 
Well, you know what they say about assuming. It makes me beautiful. Ha. Oh, is that what they say? Yes. Okay. I don't really know what they say. I was actually Don't ask asking. Them. Don't ask them. <laughs> I'm telling the truth, I swear. I'm sure I'm nowhere near the level yet. Don't worry so much about that. You do your own thing. Just keep exploring and learning by trying new things. Sometimes my brain lags and I forget that I'm reading a sentence. Yeah, that happens too. <laughs> I'm sure I'll end up trying different things a lot. Wait, no, um, that's you. <laughs> I got sure really good at voice acting. Yeah, I usually read the sentence as it goes first and then I read it. Good. That helps And then me. it makes sense. Yeah, that helps me not have a brain lag that I read. I'm sure I'll end up trying different things a lot. It could take a while yes, before I feel comfortable doing this. That's okay. Yes, Tashi. My the tales of my beauty is from far and wide. <laughs> to see you try new things. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> That's only for Yuri. Oh, no. That's the best way to find. That kind of style that suits you. Everyone else might be a little bit biased towards their own kinds of styles. The styles. I don't know what's happening to my sentences anymore. It's the time. You've been doing this for two hours. It gets hard. It's true. But I always help you find what suits you the most. Oh, and Tasha, don't clip that what I just said. <laughs> you just gave her an idea. <laughs> so All don't right. force yourself to write the way around. Wait. So don't force yourself to write the way everyone else wants you to write. I do what I want. What if you that's what I want? Me. It's not like you have to worry about impressing them or anything. <laughs> anyway, do you want to read my poem now? Do you want no, to read I my don't. poem now? Yes, you do. Don't worry, I'm not very <laughs> good. You sound pretty confident for someone who claims to not be very good. Fake it, you make it, girlfriend. <laughs> well, it's because I have to sound confident. That doesn't mean I always feel that way, you know. I see. Well, let's read it then. <sighs> Hole in the wall. It could have been me. See the direct this pull protrudes. Noisy neighbor, an angry boyfriend. I'll never know I wasn't home. I pay inside for a clue. No, I can't see. I reel blind. I reel blind. Like a film left out in the sun. But it's too late. My retinas already scorched with a permanent copy of the meaningless image. It just spat everywhere. It's just a little hole. It wasn't too bright. It was too deep, stretching forever into everything. A hole of infinite choices. I realize now that I wasn't looking in. I was looking out. And he, on the other side, was looking in. Ooh, that was pretty good. Pass Deep. It. Yeah. Pass like it? that hole. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder where he was looking into. So, <laughs> oh no. Is this an, 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 an Is this an, an analogy for being born? Just a little bit. <laughs> so what do you think? Hmm. It's very freeform, if that's what you call it. Sorry, I'm not really the right person wow, to ask for feedback. It's okay. It's okay. Chill, Browski. It's just a prank, bro. Yeah. It's just a prank, bro. The kind of sky style has gotten pretty popular nowadays. 
That is, a lot of poems have been putting emphasis on the timing between words and line. And I read it like a boss. <laughs> I have no idea what any of that means. Yes. When performing out loud, it can be really powerful. Oh, know, so like spoken so word. Yeah, probably. What was the inspiration behind this one? Ah. You don't need to know. <laughs> I was looking up my butt. Well, I'm not sure if I know how to put it. I guess you could say that I have some kind of epiphany recently. Are you pregnant? Maybe. You're the father. Mommy. Oh no. It's been influencing my poems a lot. An epiphany? Yeah, something like that. Staring into your soul. <laughs> to be fair, we knew each other for a while. We just actually talked to each other yesterday. <laughs> I don't know if she's been sneaking into my room. Maybe. Probably. I'm kind of nervous to talk about deep stuff like that because it's kind of coming on strongly. Yeah, no, she definitely has my child. <laughs> she... Okay, without your knowledge. Yeah. Maybe after everyone is better friends with each other. Don't go change in the conversation. We... What did I do? <laughs> I would have been sleeping. <laughs> I feel just as grossed out about it as everyone else. I'm not sure. Hey, no, let's not say that. It was voluntary, I swear. Delete that. Anyway. Who asked to be real? How do I delete that? You can't this delete messages. This is on Twitch. the internet now. Yeah. Too hot for Twitch. Yeah, too hot for Twitch. Here's one of the writing tip of the day. Tyrus, I'm sorry, Tashi, but I have to ban you. <laughs> <laughs> you can't fire me. I'll fire myself. Yes. If you try so hard to make it perfect, then you'll never make any progress. Sound advice. Sound uh -huh, pretty sound. Uh -huh. I'm living proof. Just force yourself to get something down on paper and tidy it up later. Anyway, to think about think about it like this. If you keep your pen in the same spot for too long, you'll just get a big dark puddle of ink where your sorrows and your horrors can stare right back at you. Stare into the abyss and the abyss stares back into you or something like that? Yes. So just move your hand and go with the flow, like the ink from the pen and the water in your eyes. The tears, they just keep flowing. <laughs> You're crying while you're writing. <laughs> Eyes closed, just writing. <laughs> my hands are hurting. I'm going to get stop. That's my advice for the day. Thanks for listening to my TED talk. <laughs> Phew. I guess that's everyone. I glance around the room. Tashi! Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> that's a little more stressful than I anticipated. It's as if everyone's judging me for my me mediocre writing abilities. Even if they're just being nice, there's no way my poems can stand up to theirs. Well, maybe if we get a reader, that'll be fine. This is a literature club after all. I'll save just now. It seems like we're almost done. I sigh. I guess that's what I ended up getting myself into. Yeah, but he could have forgotten. Stop reminding him! <laughs> Across the room, Sayori and Monica are happily chatting. My eyes land on Yuri and Natsuki. They gingerly exchange a sheet of paper, sharing their respective poems. He could forget doing it, Tashi. Stop it! As they read in tandem, I watch each of their expressions change. Natsuki's eyebrows furrow in frustration. Meanwhile, Yuri smiles sadly. 
internet. Uh, um, <laughs> did you say something? It's nothing. Natsuki dismissively returns the poem to the desk with one hand. I guess you can say it's fancy. Winner for her. Yeah. Her small brain and her small brain writing style and her toddler handwriting. It's just too sophisticated see... for her. But Kevin, huh? did you see the space between her, her eyes? That's where that's the brain, okay? <laughs> yeah, her brain is supposed to be big enough. <laughs> maybe, maybe, maybe. Yuri's poem is just too small brain for her galaxy brain. Maybe exactly. um, Natsuki knows something that we don't. Maybe it's your problem and not hers. <laughs> yeah. Ah, uh, thanks. Yours is cute. That's because I have a coaster on, and that coaster is whoop. Hello, Skeet. Skeet. How are you today? <laughs> oh my gosh. You know what? That's, That's so, so true. true. Greetings, Keith. I am whoop. They're incredible. Cute? You can have come with a more cheesy, like. Like, um. Mm -hmm. You can have come with a more cheesy. What do you call it? Prefix for your name? Prefix or suffix? Whichever. I'm not a very English person. I don't know. I'm the mysterious, incredible. Altruistic. What does altruistic mean? Altruistic whoop. <laughs> yeah, that's better. Like one of them is uh, way too I cheesy, can't what but three of them is just fine. Indeed, indeed. It needs a three. What was this comedic thing? It was like three is a comedic number or some shit. Continue. Uh, good things come in trees, you know. Yes, that's the thing. Did you completely miss the symbolism or something? Yes. Is it the space between your eyes? Eagles fly! I guess. <laughs> I was trying to say something nice. <laughs> yeah, you need to stop. You're making me laugh more. <laughs> You're not happy? Suggestions. <laughs> if, she if I was looking for suggestions, I would have asked someone who actually liked it. You're the only one. <laughs> You're the only the one only here one. who we need a train to cross like our eyes. That's not better in my head. Between your eyes. <laughs> Insult inserted. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> Which people did, it, by the way? Theory liked it. <clears throat> and Kenny did too. <laughs> <laughs> 
No, I didn't. Yes, you did. Shut up. You ate my cupcakes. <laughs> so okay, maybe I back. could... Maybe I could be persuaded to like it for another cupcake. So based on that, I'll gladly give you some suggestions on my own. She deserves it, don't worry. She's a dog on the child. Look, when you point something out and you can't unsee it, it continuously is a thing, okay? Yeah. By the way, Tashi, I still have super glue on my fingernail. Excuse me. I appreciate the offer, but I spent a long time establishing my writing style. I don't expect to change it anytime soon, unless, of course, I come across something particularly insp inspiring, which I haven't yet. I scraped it off. Don't worry, Tashi. <laughs> Just get punched in the butt. <laughs> <laughs> and Kevy like my poem too, you know. Yeah, I thought this was gonna end soon. Yeah, I don't know why you didn't listen to me. I just wanna get out of the classroom. Even told me who was impressed by it. Very much so. Na Natsuki suddenly stands up. Oh? I didn't realize you were so invested in trying to impress our new member, Yuri. Eh? Uh, that's not what I... Ew. You, you're just... Yuri stands up as well. <laughs> maybe... Maybe you're just jealous that Kevi appreciates my advice more than he appreciates yours. <laughs> you see, everyone's picking on the child. Oh shit, that was my voice. <laughs> yeah, I think we should end now. <laughs> and how do you know he didn't appreciate my advice more? Uh, you're gonna save, right? Yes, save. You're quite nice. <laughs> All voices are just clearly struggling at this point. I already started that sentence. <laughs> All voices are just struggling at this point. <laughs> It's not a reason for you to bully the child, but it is though. I shouldn't override my saves. I'm just bad at saving, Tashi. Okay, I will not override my saves. No. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, um. Well, shall we continue this tomorrow? Okay. Yeah, this is very fun. Besides, I'm way over the time limit. Yep. Okay, well, uh, thanks. How could you do this? <laughs> yeah. Thanks for coming out, everyone. Um, mm -hmm. be sure to we follow. Let's listen mm -hmm. to our advancements, right? We had our own. We had so many clips. We got our first band. And we got our first races all in one day, oh my gosh. The first ban and the first races was the same person, so it doesn't I don't think it counts. <laughs> it was the first person, but it but it's but it's books. <laughs> mm-hmm. It counts. Two separate achievements. <laughs> yeah, that's a good achievement, honestly. I like that achievement. <laughs> that's like my biggest achievement since I joined Twitch. <laughs> and isn't it the best? It's the best achievement. Like, dude, dude, you gotta, finishing. you gotta really, like, enjoy banning people who are stupid, you know? Indeed. Anyway, um, for those new here, you can join my Discord and follow me on Twitter. And you can also, um, go on Whoops Link Trees. <clears throat> well, this is the first color on my channel. Uh, I did one with Suriko already. She's fun to yeah. stream it. And with you, Tashi. Yeah, I did one with Tashi as well. <coughs> okay, time to go. Good night, everyone. Night. See you all tomorrow. I'm gone! Bye-bye. <coughs>